All right, this is the Golden Lancer, uh, and MIB secret agent. In the car. In the car again. All right, yeah. Um, today I'll be reviewing the Pudgy Pig from season one. Season one. Now, uh, the features of this, the arms don't move at all, really. But uh, the hands do. The hands move. 360. And uh, the legs move a tiny bit. And let's not forget, if you press this helmet down, like the little thingy on the helmet, his mouth opens. And there's a hole in the back, so you can put, like, random stuff in his mouth, and it falls out the back. Because, because he can eat the world's supply of food in, in four hours. Yep. Um, yeah, it's a pretty cool figure. Uh, what year was this? Um, 1993. 93, yep. Uh, yeah, and, uh, also for review... And just so you know, this isn't my... This isn't the Golden Lancer. This is mine. Yeah. I'm letting him review it. Yep. Yeah, this is Goldar. Uh, articulation, if you move this little back thing, he goes like that. His wings move. And, uh... His legs move like that. And he's pretty. Yeah. And his legs move forward a little bit. His arms move like that. Um, his head has absolutely no articulation. And what me and MIB secret agent realized here was that Goldar has a tail. I never knew that until I got the 2010 Goldar. Yep. I got him and the pudgy pig today at the garage sale. Yep. And Shadow Borg. Yeah, Shadow Borg. And since this review is really short, we will include, include Shadow Borg, which is not mine either. Alright, so some of his features. He is a very cool looking action figure, actually. One uh, of the best Beetleborg villains. Yeah. If not, the best. Now, the only thing that's wrong with. Whoops. The only thing that's wrong with this figure is that it's missing his antennas, but I mean, it's an older figure, so. You're gonna get that, trust 1996. me. 1996. Yep, only three years after Goldar and Pudgy came out. And the year I, before I was born. Yep. Alright. Yeah, so, uh, his legs move like that, his knees like that, and the whole leg moves like that. Arms move up, down, kind of bend like that. Head, some articulation, not really, but can move three, well, no, not really. Can it move 360 or no? Um, yeah, it could. It can move 360, but it's kind of tough, too, so I don't want to rip the head off accidentally. Oh, the head fell off. Awesome! Yeah, but um, how how this figure is really rare too, so right. I seen it for twenty bucks on eBay. Twenty bucks, loose. Yep. Twenty bucks loose, which means in a little plastic bag for this. No box. Whatever. Okay. Yeah, but a uh, little plastic bag or box or card or or card. It's in insane, really, how rare this thing is. And cool it is. Yeah, it is pretty cool. Alright, well, I guess that's the end of the review. Uh, see you guys next time. Bye.